Hello and welcome to this tutorial on using the digital library and advanced search techniques. The USC Digital Library offers digital images of drawings, illuminated manuscripts, maps, photographs, posters, prints, rare illustrated books, as well as audio and video recordings from USC and collaborating institutions. Encompassing the subject strengths of the vast collections of the libraries at the University of Southern California, these materials represent the applied sciences, fine and decorative arts, history, performing arts, and social sciences. This tutorial is aimed at providing you with advanced search strategies for finding resources in the digital library. If you are interested in doing basic searches, downloading digital library images for personal use, or purchasing images and obtaining permission to use them for publication or commercial use, we've created separate tutorials for this purpose. The USC Digital Libraries offers an advanced search option from the drop-down menu next to the search bar. Click Advanced Search to open it at the top of the screen, and you can enter your search terms and provide context. For example, if you want to find photographs of Cocker Spaniels, you might type Cocker Spaniels into the first field and then add another field and choose photographs for your second search term. If you want to narrow your search even further, you can use the drop-down menus. Let's choose to find the results using the exact phrase Cocker Spaniels and use the term format to limit the results to photographs. This narrows the search to remove results that might be about photographs. Click search and see your results. There are only five results, so it is easy to browse and choose your favorites like this photograph of a litter of Cocker Spaniels. Going back to the advanced search window, you can see that there are a variety of ways to refine your search. Perhaps you are looking for photographs of the Shrine Auditorium on Jefferson Boulevard. Do an advanced search specifying format, in this case, photograph and Shrine Auditorium and hit search. This search will get you 81 results. You happen to know that Shrine Auditorium is also called the Al Malaika Temple. You can go back to the advanced search and expand your search to include results with Shrine Auditorium or Al Malaika Temple and click search. You now have 168 results that you can browse. Using the advanced window, you are also able to specify the collections to be searched by clicking add or remove collections or the time period you are interested in using by using search by date. Note that if you make any changes in the advanced search window, like picking specific collections to search, this will be remembered if you immediately reopen the advanced search window from the results page. If you want to do a different search, remember to clear these search terms. In this example, we specified that we only wanted to search for photographs in the Eileen Zhang papers collection. When we reopen the window, we'll, we will need to select clear all if we want to start a completely new advanced search. We will also need to reselect all collections to make sure that our new search does not only search the Eileen Zhang collection. Thank you for watching this tutorial on doing advanced searches in the USC Digital Library. If you are interested in learning about basic search techniques for the USC Digital Library or on how to download images for personal use or purchase images for publication and commercial use, please see our other tutorials.